Hey Legionnaires and welcome back, we are in Japan with some more Shogun 2 and this time instead of doing Last Alliance we are actually on Vanilla Shogun 2 and this is a replay I've had for a long long time, probably way over a year and uh, I thought, you know what, it'd be interesting to see whether you guys want to see more like Vanilla Shogun 2 um, and as well as obviously uh, Last Alliance, whether you'd be interested in seeing that so uh, just let me know in the comments whether you'd like to see more uh, Shogun 2, whether it's like just sieges or land battles um, using like the vanilla, like the fac factions instead of uh, some middle earth stuff instead um, because it's obviously a really fun game and uh, a lot of you guys uh, are fans of it so uh, yeah, let me know but um, yeah, this is, I, I can't even remember so we've got Mori, we've got the Mori and we have Oda on uh, this side and they are facing off against the uh, Takeda and uh, I'm not going to pronounce that name, Yusugi I Definitely butchering these names, but I do apologize. We have some fire rockets here anyway. They'll start off very early on, firing onto the uh, Takeda cavalry here, trying to hit them and hit them pretty hard. I mean, they did a lot of damage actually. Also, burning down the sword dojo here slowly. Um, but yeah, this is an insanely close land battle that takes place uh, in today's battle. And uh, yeah, definitely worth sticking around to see how this one goes. We've got some uh, horse archers here, some bow cavalry actually. And they're harassing uh, my cavalry here, some great Our guard I've got. So. Uh, there you go, and I don't know what was just shouted there. I think something about a general was in danger. We already got some wavering troops over, some great guard getting uh, broken. And you can see, look at this. Um, we've got like the great guard from the Takeda way in behind. And yeah, Hanzo's shadows as well. Producing this like a like a ninja unit or something like that. I have no idea, but these like a assassin unit or something. I have no idea, but they look cool. I can tell you that much. But yeah, here we go. I'm going to see the first clash of combat. We're going to see some uh, samurai going in. And this should be a brutal, brutal fight. To me and Nag Naginata Samurai against uh, a no, I'm no Dashi. And this is going to be the problem when it comes to <laughs> when it comes to Shogun 2. Can I pronounce the names? Um, but yeah, this looks like it's going to be. I mean, Spears. I imagine are going to lose this one against the Sword uh, Samurai just because. Well, Sword Samurai is better. <laughs> Swords always beats a Spears. That's Total War 101. We've got those rocket troops going off again. Look at that, hitting a Katana hero back here. Absolutely butchering him. I'm really, I must have been really loving these fire rockets. They're doing so much damage. They're actually getting pushed forward here by some uh, Yari Ashigaru, though. Need to worry about them. We've got some more uh, Yari Ashigaru, uh, Ashi, Ashigaru here. They are going to be a problem. We've got some gunners out the front here as well. Matchlock Samurai doing their bit. They're shooting down uh, as much of these spears as possible. We've got some uh, matchlock Ashigaru here as well. I mean, I don't know. They're probably not going to be as good as the samurai ones, I imagine. But uh, they're going to be pretty decent, I imagine. You can see here my uh, bow. I managed to catch, uh, catch the bow cavalry over here, and I routed it pretty decisively. And I'm now going in against the spears here. This probably wasn't a great idea for my great guard just to charge straight in here. But, I mean, cavalry going in against spears, never a great idea. Yeah, that's not going to end too well. And now I've actually got my, uh, my uh, samurai going in. But we did actually manage to break the spears, so that's uh, always a win. Back over here. I'm going to do a bit of slow mode because it is a very, very high intense game in, Sh uh, Sa in Shogun 2. Um, we've got Katana Cavalry coming in here. They're actually trying to deal with these uh, warrior monks um, that the Mori are bringing. They are, uh, I think they're beating back the Cav, to be honest. Yeah, oh no, winning slightly. One, well, one's losing, one's winning, so kind of hard to say. We've got Hanzo Shadows in the back here. They're uh, dealing with some, uh, looks like the General, actually. For um, the Mori, you got the Mori Montanari here. So yeah, he's actually being uh, assassinated by the Hanzo Shadows back there. We've got Cavalry, Bow Cavalry back here as well. For Takeda doing some damage. Um, it seems like the Mori is kind of a little bit going overwhelmed, I would have said. Uh, certainly over here, the sun to uh, be broken, these uh, Samurai. Are, and they have also got more Warrior Monks in here. Um, so that is going um, pretty well here for Takeda. Seems like they're uh, winning their fight slowly. We've got ambush troops now coming in, it seems. And uh, finally, my uh, Yari, oh, my Yari hero actually being uh, attacked. It doesn't seem like my uh, my fire rockets are under threat just yet, which is always good. And i got some warrior monks in the back lines here. Spears, are, like, they've got some just some cavalry units here, and they're just being dealt with now. Assassinating them all. Kill them all. And then we got, uh, I've got some Mori troops, some Mori monks here come to support me. I don't know really if I need them, but I'll take them. Um, Katana Hero looks like he's about to break, actually. So that's really good. De uh, being dealt with my, my samurai. I have kind of got some samurai that kind of overextended there. And I now have some matchlock samurai. They're going to get charged here by warrior monks, and this is not going to be good. 
I mean, they are samurai, but they, uh, I guess they're more trained in using a gun than they are using a sword, so they're going to get cut down. That was a really good charge there onto my matchlocks, and yeah, getting a lot of kills there. Uh, my cavalry's now actually been dealt with, actually, over here as well by the, uh, some reinforcing cavalry, and the, uh, the actual general as well came over here, and he's been dealing with my cavalry. That's a shame now. I have no cavalry over here, so that is going to be a real, real threat. I've got more warrior monks. They look like they're going into combat, and more, uh, and more swords, uh, sword samurai being sent in to deal with these warrior monks and try and save my matchlock samurai, try and get them out of combat. But yeah, you can see already, these uh, swords not holding, not holding at all. I need to get my warrior monks in there actually to do some damage. Is that an artillery piece going off? Yeah, okay, so it seems like uh, the uh, Yusegi here have got some European cannons. It looks like some like bombards or something like that they'd be. Uh, <laughs> look at the reload. I did not realize that's how they reload them. That's kind of cool. Um, anyway, we won't stick around to see how that's going on. The cannon's kind of ripping me to shreds a little bit. I am winning over here, though. Warrior monks, look at this game. Focus down as they rush towards the archers. These uh, <laughs> warrior bow monks and they're just uh, archers. And they're focusing down my uh, my own monk. Monk boys. There you go. And look at this. The Mori is in a real state of trouble now. I mean, it's kind of coming down to like the last few troops over here for them. Got the bow hero and the katana hero, and they're doing as much damage as they can. Turn it around to the, the lighter side. You can see over here they are cutting these boys down. Katana uh, Samurai just getting cut down here. Bow Hero as well. I look at this. We've got the uh, the uh, Nodachi Samurai Samurai going in against Bow Samurai. I imagine that the Swords will win that fight. If they can catch them, they've got to catch them first. It's the main thing. And the Mori's actually over here supporting me. Um, they've probably got some of their own problems they need to be worrying about as well. I've actually managed as well to catch this matchlock Ashigaru, which is really good. We'll kill this unit off nice and quickly. But the worrying thing is that the cavalry isn't behind, and this is going to be a real problem. They've actually kind of flanked me, to be honest. I'm kind of in a real uh, bit of trouble here. Our men are but we are killing off these uh, Ashigaru very quickly. I've got some matchlock samurai coming up, and they're going to be hopefully able to deal with these bows. I also managed to get my uh, warrior monks into combat against bow uh, monks, so that's also really, really good. I've silenced the gun, like the uh, artillery piece back here, the uh, warrior monks, and we're trying to now loop around. Um, Takeda looks like he might be about to win against Mori, but it's very hard to tell. It's really just generally hard to tell who's going to win on the side. I can't remember who wins. Such a long time ago this battle was fought. The cab in here supporting... Is, uh, they need to keep like cycling charge, doing cycle charges, I think. But they get a much better uh, result instead of just staying in combat. The spears, these are going to be doing pretty well, these warrior monks. They're pretty nasty. I have to bring them more often. They are losing slightly, though. They're fighting in over here as well. I mean, against Samurai, I don't think they're going to win this fight. There you go. It uh, looks like we've just just about routed everything here, but they still have a lot of like bow uh, warrior monks, which is going to be a problem. And it's still not really over. He's still got a really like strong general here, who's like doing a lot of damage to my infantry. I don't know what these. Uh, we've got katana samurai here that are coming in. Seen a lot of action. Just a lot of yeah, a lot of katana samurai. And there you go. It looked like the Mori is well and truly gone. Uh, well, they're not quite gone. I don't know like why it's, it's said that, but there is like one or two units left. The Mori actually are kind of over here with that Katana hero <laughs> chasing down Bow Samurai. I don't think that's going to end too well. But uh, as you can see, we're trying to just catch as much of this uh, these warrior monks as possible. So they can't just shoot us and gun us down. Because that's really what they want to do. So many warrior monks dying for their, for their side, for their clan, I guess you'd say. Don't really know a lot about like Japanese history, so it'd be interesting to uh, to do more like Shogun Two, maybe even do like a campaign, maybe sometime. A general has fallen. Uh, I presume, yeah, that's the uh, general over here. He was fighting in the katana, like the katana samurai here. He has uh, fallen, and you can see we are starting to turn around over here. We're now catching more of these warrior monk bows, and um, the Takeda's still alive over here, though. They're still doing a little bit of damage, but. 
They're also nearly spent. They've still got one of these ninjas. They got, oh my gosh, these have explosives. Surely they cannot be good for their own side. This is the uh, Yusegi. They've got these these uh, ninjas. I mean, they're just blowing up everything. They're blowing up friend and foe in there, I'm sure. Like, oh my gosh. Yeah, they cannot be killing. Like, like there's one or two Katana heroes. It's not worth turning, uh, shooting them. I want to see these guys like actually fire a proper unit. They're going to like fire this unit? They got How close are they getting? Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that explosion. That's going to route that unit surely. It's down to 60 minutes. That was a fresh unit as well. Look, they're desperately trying to chase these, uh, these ninjas. Look at this brave ninja. Ha, ah, you die. You can't throw any more weapons now. Are they going to throw more explosives? No, they're going into combat. They'll probably route this unit. They needed. They should have really done that. They should have like thrown their uh, explosive and then just gone into combat, perhaps. And they might have routed it straight away. Hard to say. There are more ninja monks. And uh, ninja monks. Uh, Naginata warrior monks arriving. Oh, and there's another like Hanzo Shadow, and this can throw explosives as well. But as you can see, we are slowly routing everything. We've routed everything over there, and we have routed the Hanzo Shadows. And I think that is it. That is all there is left. Um, I don't... Well, there's like that unit there that's routed, but it has just been uh, routed properly. And there we go. A costly victory, but what a battle. And honestly, those ninjas could have turned it around if they... Uh, they look like they had the ability to route anything. Like, they're like Nafatoons. They could have probably routed anything. Um, so we'll end the battle, and we'll have a quick look at some of the end results in a moment, and have a look at the... Uh, yeah, see who did the best, really. I imagine, like, gunners and um, explosive units are probably going to do quite well. I don't know. We'll have to see. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was certainly... It's a high intense thing in Shogun 2. It is so good. Um, and the units look amazing still to this day. That's the other thing. They really do look great. So yeah, we'll have a look and see uh, see who's done the best. I have a feeling some gunner's going to do quite well. That cannon might have done quite well as well, actually. Um, but yes, let's have a look. So yes, I was playing in this one, as was Mythic. It was a long, long time ago was this battle. Um, and then we've got Escanor and Aiden were also playing in this uh, in this battle. So have a quick look at some of the unit stats. Uh, I think this is my army. So yeah, actually my warrior monks getting 229 kills. That's actually pretty good. And another one getting 200. So yeah, these warrior monks, you know, they are pretty good to bring. They're a really good unit. Great guard getting 152 kills. My fire rockets before they got taken out getting 151. Another really fun unit to see uh, brought to the battlefield. I definitely would bring them again. No Darky Samurai getting 141. Katana Hero getting 99 kills. Matchlock Samurai getting 82. Not too bad. Um, what else have we got here? That did pretty well. Let's have a look at Eskinal's army. Eskinal was uh, playing as... I can't remember. He was playing as the Takeda, I think. Um, his Warrior Monks as well doing really well. 234 kills. These guys are insanely good, it would seem. 201, like, 233. Really good kills there. Spears of uh, Shenzhou. Gate? I don't know how you say that, but they, the cavalry did there got really did, uh, did really well. 191 kills. Um, Bow monks getting 126. Matchlock Ashigaru down here getting uh, 107, doing pretty well. European cannons getting 139, uh, getting 39. Sorry. Um, maybe, maybe not. Maybe that was. Um, maybe he was playing as Yusegi. I don't know because I don't know if the others, the other uh, faction had a uh, European gun. Uh, doesn't look like it did. So, yeah. So, I must, I must have been facing Eskinor. It's been such a long time since I've played this one. And then Mythic got some really good kills with his Katana Heroes. 277. Um, his Warrior Monks also doing well, getting 180 kills. Uh, Yari Hero getting, 100, uh, getting 86, sorry. Um, but, yeah, some pretty good kills here. Keisha Ninja getting uh, 32 kills. Um, but yeah, nothing too insane there for them. And then again, obviously, Warrior Monk's nearly high at the top. Do, uh, no Darky Samurai, 142. Shame that Aiden, Aiden didn't get anything that got into the 200s, sadly. Um, I want to see where is uh, Takeda Fire Cavalry. Did not see that unit. They got 106 kills. Um, and then the... Anything else on here that did really well? Nothing like too good. Oh, Hanzo Shadows. There, I saw them. They got 97 kills. Where are the... Other, um, where are the other explosive units? Where are they? Kisho Ninja. Was that them there? Yeah, the Kisho Ninjas. They got 22 kills. That's a shame. They didn't get more. 
They look really cool, though. We'll have to see with, whether in another battle they can do even better. But, uh, yeah, I think I got, yeah, just about got the more, most kills in that battle. It was a very close battle, though. Um, so, yeah, thank you for everyone that joined in this one. It was a long time ago. Let me know in the comments if you want to see more uh, Shogun 2, um, whether it's, like, land battles, sieges. We could even probably do naval battles, perhaps. Um, and I certainly would maybe do some streams of it, like some streams uh, of Shogun 2, some sieges and land battles and that, because it's a very fun, uh, like, game. And I'm sure a lot of you uh, guys have it and would love to play it uh, along with us. But yes, until next time, Legionnaires, I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.